Randy with Missouri 811 joins us now. Randy, thanks for being here in studio. How are you? Oh, it's my pleasure. Good. Thank you so much, Blake and Joy. And hello, everybody in 417. I yep. guess we bleed over in probably 573. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're excited to learn more about kind of you and your business. So tell us what exactly is Missouri 811? Missouri 811 is the notification center that is authorized by the Underground Damage Prevention Act. People probably knew us before as Missouri One Call. Everybody in the world has always referred to us as Dig Right, even okay. though that has never been the, the formal name of the organization. So as the organization, as the notification center, people contact us when they're going to excavate in Missouri. Mm -hmm. Then we look at where they're going to excavate and we see what utilities are in that area. And then we notify the utilities and then they mark their utilities. Very okay. interesting. Yeah. So beyond that, kind of how does your system work with what you all do? Well, the system works as an excavator contacts us. <clears throat> and uh, the old idea of call before you dig is still true. But actually, we really say click or call before you dig because 85% of our locate requests are done online. Mm. <clears throat> And so when you contact us on that day, that day does not count, then one day, two day, and then the next day you can excavate. So if you contact us on Monday, Monday does not count. Tuesday, Wednesday is allowed for the utilities to locate their utilities, mm -hmm. and then you can excavate on Thursday. Naturally, weekends and stay recognized holidays get in the way of that too. So you're the, you're the guy that's before the utility company. Correct. Okay. okay. So that's, no, that that's good sense. to know. Yeah. So who is using the system? Is it just you all? Is it homeowners? Is it someone else we need to be aware of? Everybody uses Everybody. the system of homeowners. If it doesn't matter if you're going to put in a, a tree in your yard or a new mailbox or if you're going to expand I-70. Mm -hmm. Everybody's that's going to be involved with the Missouri 811 system. Yeah. So you have that, that yes. breadth of projects from <clears throat> yes. little ones to a mailbox to a highway. Yes, okay. very definitely. Interesting. And as everyone knows, uh, right now in Missouri, we have a large broadband bill oh, that is going yes. on. Yeah. So that is really one of the busiest activities that's going on statewide. Ah, okay. Tell us a little bit more about that. Well, the uh, it started with the ARPA, mm -hmm. and then the Infrastructure Act has provided funding through the Department of Economic Development, mm -hmm. who is providing uh, funding for internet service providers to expand broadband throughout rural Missouri. Mm -hmm. So you can naturally see as they're oh. going through their expansion. You're a busy it, it, guy. It, it's so, very much so. <laughs> You're yeah. very busy. Yeah. So kind of on the other side of this, what are like some consequences that homeowners should be aware of if they're not using the systems that you kind of guys help put in place? There's a few consequences to okay. keep in mind. One is you may be the person who knocks out the internet in the, in the neighborhood. Oh, no. Nobody you wants don't that. Be that <laughs> do, do not be that you person. You know, definitely not. Uh, the other is you just may break a utility. Mm. And particularly if you break a utility during excavation without a locate, you can be held liable for the cost of the repair. Oh, wow. That so can't if, be cheap. No, you know, if it's, if it's like a phone line, an old phone line, that is pretty easy to repair. Fiber, to, oh. to reassemble a fiber line is really, that can be in the thousands of dollars. Now, the biggest concern and the one we really pay attention to is being safe. Mm -hmm. So, um, you look at things like gas lines, electric lines, you definitely don't want to cut into one of those because mm -hmm. that can really ruin your day. Yeah, absolutely. And we don't want a day ruined yeah. or the internet taken out from no, the whole neighborhood. No, like no, no, that sounds days, like worst case scenario. There are days yeah. when that yes. would be okay. So <laughs> yeah. You're literally an ounce of prevention kind of guy, right? Yes, it is. It's just you a know, simple it's, phone call. It's enhancing public safety and preventing damage to underground utilities. That's our mission statement. Yeah, which is incredible. So if people want to get a hold of you, want to call you, how do they do that? Missouri811.org. Perfect. Or 811. 811. There you go. <laughs> yes. Easy as can be. Yes. Yeah, so, Randy, thank you so much thank for being you. here. Thank you. It's very informative and very helpful. So, we thank appreciate you. it. Thank you. It's been yes. great to be here. Yes.